there's more and more children suffering with different uh, forms of mental health, people not being able to go to school, not being able to go out and meet their friends, um, you know, and so it, it seems to have really uh, multiplied. We have all these adults that are struggling with this trauma, they're struggling with this PTSD, and, um, you know, they're just stuck in this kind of bit where they don't, they've kind of lost all hope. The community approach helps because it's mm -hmm. much closer to where people live. They're more mm -hmm. comfortable going into that situation. Being feeling like you're not worthy almost 20 hours a day, mm -hmm. you know, you can't be, and you come into the project and it can be who they are for that little two hours window as well. It is about recognising when you're not coping. Mm -hmm. I know people have been through COVID, you know, that's, they lived isolated for three years and we're still seeing an impact on that. And I think parents as well are struggling because they haven't got the tools or the skills yeah. to cope. They don't know what to do and where do they get advice from. Probably the biggest issue is where do you go for support? How do you know yeah. where to go for support? 52% of the clients that uh, we see at the moment come from Aberdeen, sort of most deprived communities as well. If the GPs don't know where to go, how are individuals supposed to have any idea of where of where they're where they should go? It's a big step to take asking for help. It's you know putting yourself vulnerable, but that's the first step and saying, Do you know what, I'm struggling. I don't honestly think there's ever gonna be a point where anybody's gonna be saying that we've got enough money to deal with you know, the demand for whichever service yeah. it is. It's your mental health, and if you wait too long for someone someone to do it, you may never recover from it. Having mental health or mental health issues is just part of being human. It's an absolutely normal thing. Mm -hmm. um, you, f you shouldn't feel uh, ashamed about it, and there's always somebody there to help you.